Oh, uh, it's our favorite time of the week. Lynn's here from the Humane Society. I got a little buddy over here you now. You do. Yours is very he sweet. He just curled up here oh. and looks like looking up at me like Looks like he's ready to me. take a nap. Yeah. So you have Smokey and I have Thunder. Um, and I don't know, Katie, is there going to be any thunder out there? <laughs> We've got some in the studio right now. Uh, thunder and Smokey are two months old. They spent the last two weeks in, um, in an amazing foster home. Mm -hmm. Obviously very social. Uh oh, Thunder just discovered where uh, Smokey is and wants to go play. Um, really social. Uh, they said they're both really playful and affectionate. Thunder likes to, like, if you sit down on the couch or on a chair, mm -hmm. plops down with you, and he proved that as true out in the um, out in the newsroom. So if you're looking for some kitties that are going to make a really easy transition into the home, mm -hmm. I think these guys are going to be it. Do they need to go together? They do not. You okay. can adopt them out separately. Um, of course, you know, um, a lot of times having two kittens can make it easier if you have an older cat because then they can play with each other. Right. Um, but you certainly do not have to, don't feel obligated to adopt them both by any means. Um, if you're not you looking around. to yeah. adopt or add a kitten to your mm -hmm. family right now, we definitely are um, in need of foster homes, especially those willing to take on socializing those kittens that maybe are a little bit spicy, a little <laughs> bit needing to come out of their shell. Uh -huh. um, so um, if you need information, check us out at the Humane Society. Information on fostering is online on our website. All right. Well, we got two adorable kittens. They need homes. And uh, so you're open tomorrow. They like to get adoption started by 430 tomorrow. Okay. We got to take a break. We'll be right back.